Grandpa Newbie reporting for duty. So what about this blaze up event? I didn't have time to look at it until earlier today. And I decided to have a look, get the camo and rage through a couple of maps. Well, actually it was more than a couple of maps. So there are 11 challenges that seem like a lot to me. And here they are, 25 clean kills, akimbo, 10 quick scopes with stalker boots, 20 direct impact launchers, Use attack mask, hit 20 operators with tear gas. Use a stem or battle rage 15 times. Now, this is the first one that didn't work out the way I thought it would. I thought I could just spawn, use the stem, and it would count. It doesn't. You got to get wounded and then use the stem to regain full health. That's when it counts. Four kills within 20 seconds. I actually got this one done before I knew there was even an event. I was shooting a different video and the completion showed up. So that one there is the only one that you can do on its own and you'll be doing it the whole time until you get it. Next one, demo vest, demolition, stick 10 with a thermite or Semtex. 20 kills while in smoke with Jack Purifier equipped. This is the second one that didn't work the way I thought it was. You can equip the Jack Purifier. I would put on a thermal scope and then drop the smoke. Don't worry about using the Jack Purifier. Get in the smoke and look through the thermal scope. That's how e the easiest way to get the kills. Next one, engineer vest, use an inflatable decoy 15 times. That one is straightforward. Kill 25 with a cooked frag or thermobaric grenade, straightforward. And then while sliding or crouching, 40 kills with a dragon's breath ammunition. It looked like a bunch of doable things, but gobbledly gooped me in terms of how do I plan for this? So I sat down and I planned out the uh, classes I would be using and it really boiled down to three groups. So for group one, the challenges would be 25 clean kills, akimbo, 10 quick scopes with tack mask, hit 20 operators with tear gas. And the class I would use for that would be the XRK, WSP Stinger, akimbo, obviously attack mask and, and tear gas. The second class that I needed was for the group two what i call the group two challenges 20 impact direct impact launcher kills use the stem or battle rage 15 times and we've talked about how you've got to get wounded for the stem in order for it to work 20 kills while in smoke with jack purifier equipped not with jack purifier you can kill with your bullets Obviously, the engineer vest used an inflatable decoy 15 times that also gives you double stem shots. So the class I set up was an SVS 545 with jack purifier underbarrel, the RGL 80, because it's easier to get direct kills, in my opinion, with the RGL 80. You also have at least six shots, smoke grenades, an engineer vest, and the inflatable decoy. For the group three challenges, I grouped the demo vest stick 10 with thermite or Semtex, kill 25 with a cooked frag grenade or thermobaric, and the Einsteins among you will see that you can't do both of those with the same class unless you switch out from thermite or Semtex to frag or thermobaric once the sticking is done. And then while sliding or crouching, 40 kills with a dragon's breath. And here's my class. Demolition vest, Semtex or Thermite, the Lockwood 680 with dragon's breath, ammo, and a frag or a Semtex, depending on which one of those challenges I'm going for. So it worked out quite well for me. It took about an hour to two hours to get it completed. A lot of fun. Let's go in and look at some of the results. All right, let's launch this event. First thing we're going after are the quick scopes. We're after the really the group one items. So it's going to be quick scopes with the stalker boots, tack mask, 20, 20 uh, tear gases, and 25 clean kills akimbo. There's an akimbo. We doubled up several times. We gas somebody. 
I don't think we got anything on that. And we, but we did on that for sure. We gassed somebody and then we, like right there, quick scoped them. Ha <laughs> ha. It would have been much more difficult for me to get this done in a expeditious manner. I spawned behind that guy had I not planned it out because there are so many moving parts. It's a very complex event. Nothing's really all that hard to get, but it's a complex event. I think I only need one more quick scope there. Did that do it for me? Nope, not quite. Yep, it sure did. So the quick scopes are done. Now, if you're not comfortable, I'm, I'm not super comfortable sniping. Although I enjoy it. If um, it doesn't specify a sniper, it just says quick scopes. And there's the second one. The 25, or no, that, that was the grenades. That was the tear gas. So we're done with two, actually three, because I did another one before when I didn't realize I was in the event. And there's the akimbo completed. Now we have four completed out of the 11. And I'm going to switch to a thermal scope, but unfortunately we can't do that in game. There's a bug that has been acknowledged. Now the RGL-80 just harvests people. It just absolutely reaps. Direct hits are easier to get on that than any other launcher. And you don't have to worry about reloading after every, just after six. And it's just like quick scoping. All right, I'm sitting in the middle of my smoke. You don't need to use the flame in the smoke, the purifier, in order to ring the bell. There are the launcher kills. Easy peasy. I didn't see a flash. Now I'm going to throw out smoke and shoot or just sit in the middle of it. Lay down in the middle of it. A little bit of a wall bang there. That guy was a pain. Oh, there, I got him on my last bullet. And there's the purifier. Challenge completed. So I always check the status. And I also use in-game tracking because many times I have thought that I had the right configuration. There's a stick. But it doesn't count if it's an assist. The stick has to kill them. The grenade has to explode. Many times I have thought that I had the right configuration. I was sure that I was beating down a challenge only to find out... I misunderstood something. There's a stick. There's a stick. Now, I died a lot sticking in it only because I could have killed them with my weapon, but I'd stick them and run. There's a popcorn, and the popcorn does it for us on the stick. So, no more demolition vest? Well, actually, one more. We have to do the grenade. Cook grenades. So, I switched to the shotgun and also worked with the stem with the stem i used the engineer vest because it gave you two shots now and it recharged them now one thing to keep in mind is you have to take damage for it to work i also threw out the dummy the rubber dummy so you can't just stick a stem in you at spawn time and expect it to ring the bell it won't it won't count I really enjoyed using the shotgun because this was the first configuration that they didn't force on me too much. I love the Lockwood 680. There's a stem. I took damage. And a, a lot of times I'd also just peek out or intentionally go through fire and take some damage. There's double kill while stemming. Oh, good. There's some beautiful damage there. Beautiful damage. Best damage I've ever seen. And there we go. Event completed. The dragon's breath. We just have the stem to go. We can hop the same as she can. And bless her heart. She put a hurt into me. So I got a stem out of that. This guy here wouldn't see me. And there's the inflatable dummy. Team shooting at it. 
And there's the 40 Dragon's Breath kills completed. Like I said, of playtime, it took about an hour. There's a good stem shot. I just need two more. That should... Oh, I just needed one. There's the stem completed. Now all I have to do is cook up some grenades and toss them at my friends on the other team. And when I say friends, I don't mean that literally, so don't take away a conspiracy that I have friends on the other team. I'm, I play solo. And that's the dummy inflation. So we're co I cooked a grenade so much I cooked myself. It's a cook grenade. I won't show you all of these. So I just basically raged around with the demolition vest on to get two of them. And to have them actually recharge. Popcorn's a beautiful word. And there we go. Just need seven more. I won't show you all seven. And that beautiful camo is ours. Don't even have to make payments on it. Yeah, you tend to let people go by, and there it is, the last cooked grenade. And that is the last challenge. Like I said, the other one I had already completed earlier, not knowing I was doing it. There's the blaze up complete. Camo belongs to Grandpa Newbie. Peace.